Hi, my name is Danny, and welcome to Esoteric Moment. This video is going to be super short, but I just wanted to do a quick wrap up of 2016 Booktubeathon. This was my first time participating in Booktubeathon as more than just a viewer. I had grand aspirations of creating all the videos, doing all the Instagram, and reading seven books while going to my normal day job. Needless to say, that didn't quite happen. However, I did get one video challenge done. I also completed four or five of the Instagram photo challenges, so I feel pretty good about that one. And most importantly, I did really well on reading challenges. I finished five books, four of which were ones that I anticipated reading. I finished Echo by Francesca Leah Block, which was great. Um, it wasn't quite as intriguing to me as I was a teenage fairy or wheezy bat, but it was interesting and followed many of the themes that my favorite author usually does. Love, teenage, angst, and kind of self-discovery. I also finished Children of the Sea, which is a graphic novel, and was so cool. I am looking for the next few volumes in the series, and I'm really interested to see what happens to the characters and whether they discover how people are disappearing and what meteorites have to do with it all. I also finished The Elfstones of Shannara, which was drastically different than the MTV interpretation of that, and it also counted as a book that was older than I am. It's pretty good. I do think Terry Brooks has books and series that are better. The writing is meh, but it's a fantasy novel that's really fun and the characters are interesting. I also listened to the audiobook Fangirl, which is about two twins that go off to college, one of who is a big fan fiction writer, and she falls in love and what that all means to her in her first year of college. I especially enjoyed this book and I can see why so many people on YouTube recommended it. If you haven't checked it out, I really think it's a great read. The audiobook, the audiobook was decent, but not anything to write home about, so take your pick on reading format. I also read Mome, which is a kind of collection of different graphic novels um, and different artists thrown together. It was interesting, but not my cup of tea, frankly. That's what I accomplished in this past week, and I think I did a pretty good job at my first book, Tubathon. I think maybe I'd give myself like C plus, B minus maybe, if I was feeling generous. Participation, that's what counts, right? I'm looking forward to doing it again next year, and I think I'll just set aside more time so that I can let the creativity flourish. I'm still reading lots, and I also have more videos that are about my personal druid practice and different things that I'm working on project-wise, so stay tuned. I promise it's not all books all the time. Comments below, I'd love to hear how many books you read last week and whether you participated in Booktubeathon with me. Thanks for watching, and as always, may you find peace in the sacred grove.